Hi everyone. I just want to talk about chickens today. Um, so bear with me. I just want to talk about are chickens healthy? And I just want to give you a very quick rundown of the start to finish and let you decide whether or not you think that they're healthy. So a chicken from being hatched goes into a shed with hundreds and hundreds of other chickens and they stay there for between five to eight weeks, usually slaughtered around six weeks. So from going into the shed, they are intensely fed and it's the equivalent of like taking a two-year-old and making that two-year-old 300 pounds in weight. So they're intensely fed for this um, six-week period and because there's so many of them in this shed and they're in there from start to finish, no one cleans the shed while they're in there for that period of time. It gets cleaned at the beginning for them to go in and it gets cleaned at the end because obviously you can't just keep taking all those chickens out to start being very clean. So over that six week period, they are living in their own feces and their own urine for that whole period. And they all are together, all feeding and defecating together. So because they are babies, their immune system has never been given the time to develop just like normal babies so and because they don't have an immunity this is such a diseased environment and an unnatural environment they're meant to be outdoors in the fresh air in grass you know just um, scratching a, along the soil it's so unnatural that obviously they're going to get diseased and because they have no immunity, they have to be vaccinated. So they have to have these vaccinations that are either put in their water or in sprays just to keep them alive because the disease will kill them because they're babies. So they are kept alive by the fact that they are being vaccinated. So when the six weeks is up, Lots of them are already dead. They've been living amongst the other dead ones. Um, they are all taken and put onto these lorries, taken to the slaughterhouse, which some of them don't make the journey because they are weak, sick babies. And they make that journey to the slaughterhouse where they are processed at a rate of between 12,000 to 20,000 chickens an hour. So that process, I don't know whether they process the dead ones and the alive ones. I have no idea. I don't know what the, um, the, the greed of those factories, how they would consider that. So they must have their own processes in place. But I don't know that, you don't know that. So these six week old babies that have been vaccinated, intensely fed, they are making it into the supermarkets and then onto your plate. So you tell me, is that healthy? What do you think? Like your common sense can work it out for itself. So even if you just have no moral values as to regard to the bird itself, and you just have no consideration and you don't think about birds and whether or not you think that their life from start to finish should be any more valuable than that, even if you don't consider that, at least consider the health of your children and your family and yourself. You know, you're putting it into your mouth and that's what it is. But the industry doesn't want you to see that because if you saw it, you'd be like, I'm not eating that. So I just wanted to share that information because this is kind of my purpose in life. And I don't re really think that there's anything more important that I could be doing with my life. Um, so when I see people saying um, commenting on posts saying oh get a life like what would I be doing what would I be doing that would be more important than this or get a job I have a job or yummy tasty chicken well no not yummy tasty chicken I can't think of anything more disgusting to put in my body than than that so um just to let you know, there are lots of other alternatives. There's an alternative to chicken. There's lots of wonderful product products from things, people like fries, 
they make fantastic chicken nuggets my children don't know the difference between them you can have them with ketchup they taste wonderful um, obviously it's a chicken style nugget you can get chicken style burgers you can get Linda McCartney's you don't have to do this you don't have to pay towards it and you don't have to suffer the health consequences of it and if you think that cancer is coming down and that the health in our country is getting better because of all this healthy chicken then just have a look have a look around yourself and educate yourself so that's my little um, piece of information today I hope that you got something from it and see you later bye bye